Christian culture is an indispensable part of American culture. On campus of NC State, there is a group of people representing God, helping Native students as well as international students to taste the different cultures and bridge international students to the local community. Hi, good afternoon. Good afternoon. I'm happy you accept my interview. Please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Marian Pickman, and I am a member of Grace Community Church in Raleigh. What's your mission in Grace Church? My husband and I and our friends reach out to international students and we try to give them a little bit of a taste of American culture and American way of life. Why do you think Grace Church put efforts into doing this? Because there are several、uh, places in the Bible where it says that we are to help、uh, strangers living in our land. And so we try to reach out to people who are new here and help them learn a little bit about America. It has been a tradition of the Grace Church to reach out to international students.、Uh, yes, it's been. We've been doing this for about five years, and we've met a lot of really interesting people and fun people, and it's been、um, a great learning experience for us, and hopefully also for international students. Yeah. And usually, what we do is we, when all the major holidays come up, we try to organize something special. For example. In the fall, we do a pumpkin carving、uh, contest, and、uh, at Thanksgiving we have thanks traditional Thanksgiving dinner. At Christmas we do a Christmas Eve celebration.、Uh, we have an Easter celebration. We also do、uh, a picnic at the lake on Memorial Day and go kayaking and canoeing. And throughout the year, we also take trips to the beach, to museums, have people over to play games. So we do quite a variety of activities. We will also take、um, international students because a lot of them don't have driver's license. We'll take them shopping or to the mall. Where do most of the international students come from? Okay,、um, a lot of them come from China and India, but we also have、uh, met students from all parts of Africa, from Rwanda, Ethiopia, South Africa, Zimbabwe,、uh, Kenya. We've met people from Europe, Germany, Austria, Spain. Uh, South America,、uh, Brazil. So there is quite a variety of students from many different lands here, and it's、mm-hmm. always very interesting and exciting to meet them and learn about their different cultures. What's、yeah. the biggest challenge connecting to those international students? The biggest、uh, difficulty is just the language barrier. I know international students here have to know、uh, a certain amount of English before they get accepted at、uh, NC State. But that English, a lot of times, is written English, so speech is not quite as good. And so sometimes we have to,、uh, you know, repeat things and not be shy about, "Hey, I didn't understand that. Can you repeat it?" And so sometimes you're gesturing, you're you're using your hands, you're pointing at things to figure out what somebody is saying. But it's great as long as there is patience on both sides. It all it always works out. What's your favorite story in the past five years? Well. Communicating and interacting with international students. Oh wow,、um, I have a lot of really good stories. It's it's really been a joy. I think、um, in the early years,、uh, having people over, I would not always know how many people were coming, and I still don't always know how many people are coming. But one time we were celebrating the Chinese New Year, and we were we had several Chinese students who were teaching us how to make dumplings and stuff. But I thought. That we were having about 20 people over, and instead,、um, somebody brought the entire first-year statistics department、um, students. So we ended up having about 35 to 40 people, and I ran out of food. It was very embarrassing. So after that, I have learned that I need Plan A to figure out how much to cook for a dinner, but I also need Plan B and C in case I need. Um, more food, so I have a freezer now that、mm-hmm. if something happens and more people come, I can always run out and get something and put it in the microwave. It's really a blessing for both American students and international students to have such a group of people to serve and, and contribute to bridge gaps and build friendships of different cultures in NC State and the local community. With their help. International students have been more open-minded and active to reach out 
and immerse themselves into authentic American life and culture.